New details are emerging about the biggest layoff notice filed in San Diego this decade. Today, tech giant Qualcomm said it is letting more than a thousand workers go. Tenders reporter John Horn explains how the pink slips could hurt more than just the workers. Scott Reeker knows a lot of Qualcomm employees, and he doesn't even work there. We see a lot of them up there that we've become friends with. For 17 years, Reeker has served as the office manager of Sorrento Valley Optometric Center, steps from the tech giant. He says about 20% of their business is made up of Qualcomm employees. There's enough of them that uh, it would give business to just about anyone around. That business is about to get squeezed. Qualcomm just announced that it is cutting more than 1,300 of its San Diego workers. The 10% reduction makes for the largest layoff this decade in the county. The tech giant is trying to cut more than $1.4 billion and boost its bottom line. The stock is near a 52-week low amid earlier troubles in China and a sluggish smartphone market. The moves will affect more than just the pink-slipped workers. A report by the Regional Economic Development Corporation says every job at Qualcomm supports more than two other jobs in the region. But yes, we're concerned about it. We're expecting to see a, at least a little of a, bit of a drop off. For now, Reeker says the Optometric Center is going to rely on customer loyalty. Hopefully they'll still come to see us as long as they stay in the area. In Sorrento Valley, John Horn, 10 News. All right, Qualcomm's stock, though, remained almost unchanged before today's layoff. Notices were even made public. At the end of the day, the stock did fall less than a point to close just under 55.